if I can show you there. This is the sample one that gave me a different flavor. So I gotta get this workout in. Today I'm gonna be doing a different video. I don't know how I'm gonna put this in the week vlog or do a review of the product, but I'm gonna do some juicing and cleansing soon. So I'm gonna show you guys some of that stuff that I do. I gotta look up some recipes. I gotta go to the grocery store to get some good food because your girl's getting back on her health journey because I need to so bad. I've been slacking off bad. I'm healed from the other stuff that was going on. So it's only right that I really pump it up a little bit and I think I can get back into actually taking some of my supplements and stuff to help me lose the weight and really just getting back into the gym is the problem so I'm gonna get back in there and today is gonna be the first day I might not record I probably can't do much as you can tell so I'm thinking about doing a lot of cardio on the treadmill like incline because the one I have at home I can't do it. I don't have an incline on that treadmill so I'm gonna do that and then possibly do like abs and core and stuff and then do a lot of mobility because that's some things that I really needed to do, like working on my ankle mobility and my hips. My hips are so bad. So doing some mobility stuff, stretches, back, all that to feel really good, especially after the last time I saw you guys, the move. I was down for like two or three days sore, so I couldn't do anything. But now your girl is back. I'm about to take my Volcarn. And get pumped up for the gym. Let me crank my music up. I got some construction going on over here. Stay focused. Got my pre and per post workout snack. So let's focus on the road, get to the gym, and I'll probably see you guys during or after whatever I decide to show you guys. We'll see. Okay, so we just left Target. We got a little steal, okay? So we got this Ninja Cold Press Juicer. If you guys go to Target, they do price matching. It's $129. We missed the sale for, it was $90 or $99? $99. Yeah, $99. We went and I forgot they price checked. So when I looked online, I was trying to see everywhere who had them. Happened to go on Amazon, saw it for $52, brought it to the register, and they did it exactly for $52. How do we go from $129 to $52? So, long story short, if you guys don't go to Target, you need to go to Target to get you some steals, and they do price matching. So like I said, if you're trying to get healthy, you could probably buy two or three of the juicers for the price of one. But by this time, I don't know if they'll still be in the store, so you gotta check out and see. We're in Costco trying to get some strawberries and fruit. I know I need strawberries and blueberries. She needs other fruit so we can do some juicing today. Ugh. This is a big bag of oranges. I think they have the best blueberries. You know what? This is the same brand from Aldi now though. But these from Costco for some reason are bigger. I just found hot honey in Costco. Or oh, you can habanero. Oh, habanero and scotch bonnet pepper. Chicken pizza, but I don't even like honey. Yep, it says to top it on uh, chicken or pizza. Yeah. I ice, look, ice cream. Brown. Where? Fresh melon. Ew. Real vegetable. I know they don't put these on brownies and stuff. Shrimp, okay. <gasps> I was gonna make some other stuff. Okay, I'm getting it. They're on the way back, I told you. I told you when we were in Aldi, he sent me that text. Oh. Whoa, they have bread? Oh, so it did. Did it come with this or no? They're just saying, oh, I can visit there. Never mind. <laughs> this is what I got. Okay, we got some recipes. 
take a look. Okay guys, so I'm doing this whole juice video. If you guys wanna check out that video, I'm gonna do a whole review on this, but I'm just showing you guys so you can see. I got my strawberries, blueberries, ginger, beets. If you wanna see how I do it, you gotta go watch that other video and I'm gonna show you guys. But I'm gonna give you my honest review when I taste the drink. Okay, you ready? So this is the juice that I made and I'm gonna show, what am I not gonna show? You wanna introduce, cause you, they seem to like you on here. Hi everyone, welcome back. My name is Sonia and I do lifestyle, most of stuff. Hi everyone, I'm back again with Jazzy TV. I know you guys love me more than her, so. Anyway, I'm gonna try this smoothie, not smoothie, it's but this juice. juice. So that you, she created. I don't know what's in it. I don't know what she did to it. But it looks kind of good there. I'm going to give it a try. If I don't like it, you guys, I'm going to let you know. Do you want me to tell you what's in it or something? No, 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 no. Just do it's it. It's not bad. You make it see. I'm not poisoned. I'm not doing a prank. I don't trust you. Hold on. Be careful. That. Let me get a napkin. Be back. I'm struggling with this thing, man. This is hard. The stupid brace. I was wondering why you just pouring like that. I can't bend on them, so okay. I gotta go. I need mine too. Thought you got it for both of us, cause I made more of mine. Mom, you're gonna get it. You're getting it everywhere. You gotta no the nap. Jesus Christ. <laughs> the napkin. Y'all like my new haircut? My other daughter did it, not her, cause she don't know how to do hair. She don't even know how to breathe. Well, dang. I always know it was like ginger. That's my beats. You ready? Let's do the countdown. Cheers. To no. new beginnings. Five, four, three, two, one, go. I had to make sure she didn't poison me. It's not bad. Mm. Look what pops oh. brought. So called like go ahead. No, just slide that in camera. I guess we'll start it tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> we'll start it tomorrow. Is this pepperoni? And it's pepperoni. <laughs> why? <laughs> we just said forget the juice. Forget the juice. Wait, why are you looking at the pizza? <laughs> no. We missed the video. Ain't nobody got time for that. Dad, we were talking about the healthy journey and we everything. We're supposed to be doing. And I was showing <laughs> the juicer. I'm gonna have me a slice because I'm, I'm kind of hungry. I'm not this is lie. the healthy journey. <laughs> you didn't even wait till at least the clip was over. No, Dad, you gotta try this. This is actually pretty good. The only thing is, I probably would have liked to do the less pulp one, but yeah, I don't, I don't think like you, them. Can, you can't put berries in that though. They're saying so. Maybe I put the berries first. Less pulp. I mean, the some pulp. I have the book somewhere. You can do the berries, some pulp, and then do the um, beets, less pulp, I think. That's how I'm trying to say it. So what is all that extra in that This cup? is what came out, the pulp. See, that's what I don't like. I want all juice. This is not it. No. This is the pulp. We got the juice. Mm. They took it out. This is the juice we just poured. Well, there's a lot that came out, but. Yeah, that's all the beets at the bottom, but this is mostly beets that came out. They did a, like, you can't, oh, trust okay. me, this stuff is thick underneath. So that's how when they do those uh, breads and stuff in the parfaits, they use this, because it's still healthy to use. Oh. Okay. They made pancakes out of this and everything. I don't know about that. But when you think about it, you cut the skin and stuff off. So strawberries, like blueberry pancakes, mm -hmm. you can use that and mix oh, okay, in it. Oh, yeah. So yeah, it's good. Well, it's good, but this is better. I just don't like too much. The texture you're tasting is a combination of the strawberries and blueberries. Yeah. Cause <laughs> he's been out this whole time. Was he outside? <laughs> no, was outside this whole time. <laughs> Peace out. See y'all one love. Yeah, this is pretty good, but I am gonna have me a slice of pizza. I'll catch you guys in the next clip. Guys, guess who did a Timu haul? So I'm gonna show you guys some of the stuff that I got. Let me set this down here and I'll show you everything. Now, if you don't know, Temu is kind of like a new thing people have been using. It kind of reminds me of like Wish or something like that. As you can see, Temu, yeah, Temu. It reminds me of Wish where you can get a lot of stuff for a cheaper price. Honestly, I don't even know what I got to be honest. 
Let me just sit it over here and show you guys instead. All right, I'm gonna bring you guys closer. So I ended up getting some, I didn't realize I got this many charms though. Charms for my shoes, my Crocs. Did I really get all of these? So I got some silver and gold and then some nice black. You know it's Black History Month too, so that's even better. Oh yeah, these are nice. So I'm gonna put these on my Crocs and stuff like that. Is this Tupac? I know I saw Tupac. Yep, got Tupac. We got Nipsey. Who else we got in here? The Black Lives Matter, Black Girl Magic. There might be some more noticeable faces in here. Honestly, I don't even know what I got, but it had a lot of pieces in it. So that's why I got it. Then I got these that look really cute. I've seen on people's charms before. Where I got the fashion, you know, all that stuff. Silver little things little teddy bears cute i don't want to pull them all out yet because i might lose it like that see boom gold i got a nose ring don't ask me why to be honest i completely forgot what i got i brought these slides you know what they're supposed to be like but i wanted some comfortable cute cream shoes because i can never get them so you know they're just slides to me i got some slides see how they feel oh okay they're really soft Okay, don't mind the outfit and the junk, of course, but they're super soft. Can you see? These actually feel like really good. Now, I'm in the process, like I said. Remember I said I left this and haven't gone through it yet? Those are the shoes I'm getting rid of. I got rid of some clothes already. I got to go through my drawers. I'm going to do that today so I can fully get rid of this stupid pile in my way. But yeah, these shoes are really comfortable. I didn't take my socks off, though, because I don't feel like it. But yeah, even with basic leggings or whatever... See what I'm going for? I just need some like cream shoes. It'll be really cute. I don't remember how much these cost, but they're super comfortable. These feel really good on my feet. I'm not gonna lie. Ooh, so another thing I'm excited about. I got this three-in-one dock charger. Can you see that? So I can charge my iPhone, my AirPods, and my watch at the same time. I probably should test that to see if it's even working. I have to go back and get my uh, other phone and my watch and stuff to show you guys anyways. But I want to unbox it and set it up and see if it really works. See? Okay, so this is the little dock. Oh, okay. How do I get the chargers out? So I just peel the little plastic off, off of this. My watch can go right there. My phone can go. This is so cool because I always wanted this. And then my AirPods can go right here. I really like this. I just gotta set my desk and stuff up though so everything can look nice. Let me make a trash bottle too. Then what I really wanna try too, I got this auto shut off cup warmer. I got the blue one. It comes in blue, pink, and green. I'm about to knock stuff over. So yeah, this, I seen this online someone used before. I'm sure you get it from Amazon because I almost did until I went to Timu and wanted to try this. So this just sits on your counter. And then I thought I got the USB one, but this one's just the plug-in because like I said, I didn't get it from Amazon. I got it from Timu. They have a maintenance record you put on here. Basically all you do is plug it in and should heat up your coffee and I have a cup right here. So I'm definitely gonna test this out because I didn't finish my drink and I didn't finish my uh, coffee, the juice that I made earlier. I was talking about when I said drink. Don't need that. Ooh, put that on and see how it works. We'll come back to that. Also in this one, they sent them two separate packages shipped in two different pa packages if I didn't say that. They surely did take this thing up so nobody can get into it. They wanted to make sure all my stuff arrived. Cause they definitely taped that other box bag up. I didn't show you guys on camera, but they taped it up good. Okay. Honestly don't think I'm sending anything back. A giveaway. Ooh, February 28th. So hopefully if I get this video out for you guys, I'll scratch the codes and then you guys can use this. Let me see, I'll scratch two of them off right now so you guys can use it actually. I don't have a coin or anything. I don't keep change. Uh-oh. Okay, so I messed this code up. Let me scratch another one for you guys. Okay, that's easy, it worked. So I have 8875 free is the code. Let me put it closer, you guys can't see. And then the next one is 8876 free for the code. And I'm gonna put one on Instagram. Just in case I don't make it in time, it's gonna be on Instagram. So that's why you guys gotta follow me on this. So when I pull stuff like this, you won't miss it. So I got that. And then, Actually, I'm thinking this video, I don't know if it's going to be out by then. We'll see. If it's not going to be out by then, I'll put the code on Instagram. So that just means you probably missed out. But I got a nice silky bonnet. I don't want to put it on now, but this is a really cute color that I wanted. Make a little trash pile. I'm telling you, I really forgot what I ordered. I think I got some pajama pants because I kind of just wanted to test it out to see 
if I even like the stuff and how it came out the material. It came out pretty good. These are just some pajama shorts to wear because I like wearing shorts and just casual around the house. I don't know why. I wear shorts all year round. Shorts and a hoodie, actually. The real reason I ordered off Timu was because for some reason, I don't even think I really needed this, but they had to sell. I couldn't pass up. The bag was like $65, I think. And then it went on sale for even more for like three or five dollars and i got a laptop bag don't know why i really had to order this because my laptop is broke i can't even barely bring it anywhere that's why i'm always on my computer oh so it goes like a book bag or a side bag okay so this is really cool i see why i ordered it but yeah i got a really good deal off of this you can put your laptop in here see that lots of space inside pockets more space i can hold all my drives and equipment so this is pretty cool i do think i'm gonna order again though and they have all types of side pockets you don't need to see me open every single pocket but yeah lots of storage and space i am gonna do another one so you guys can let me know what kind of stuff you want to see because i'm definitely gonna go order some more stuff and let's see if this is hot yet let's get more. well that is hot not gonna lie my cup shape is a little weird so i don't know if it'll work or not but we're gonna keep it on and then i gotta get my cord to test this out okay so i plug this in to test and see oh snap it worked that's cool my airpods and everything's upstairs i don't feel like running upstairs to go get it but you can see it works so that's actually really really cool hey y'all i just woke up i thought i'd give you guys another clip i kind of want to show you a better representation of the pens that i got I took them all out because i was making some tiktoks so i was like let me just show you guys too so yeah this is the silver pack that i got i don't know if you can really see my head is blocking the shadow but they're really cute then i got these gold ones that i can either mix and match gold with that and then i also have the you know black history black lives matter whatever you want to call it black girl magic all that stuff they have some cute ones too look they done got cardi b and meg the style oh lord and i need to do my nails oh god so yeah they got a lot of different characters is this supposed to be just a figure because at first i almost thought that was um supposed to be cold but that's definitely not him i think they just made up a character then we got I thought this was supposed to be Kyrie. It almost looked like Kyrie, then it almost looked like Drake a little bit. But yeah, you guys can see some of the popular figures. So yeah. I got a whole lot of pins and I can finally add them in my shoes. Okay, today is Sunday. The family or mom is cooking Sunday dinner. I think I dried it out. Can I get a sneak peek? What is this? Oh. Okay, just out the chicken. We got sweet potatoes, green beans, what's in that pot? Collard greens. Open it up. Sure. Ooh. And oh, this is probably macaroni, isn't it? That I can't have. I'm not even going to look at it. But I was supposed to make my dip too, wasn't I? Well, my mac and cheese and my dip, which won't take long to make at all because we're having Sunday dinner here. Might show you guys, might not. But I wanted to show you this. Actually, first off, it's been feeling good. I'm about to sit here. This is probably not the best idea with the door open, me sitting here. I just thought about that, Ma. The weather has been very bipolar. It feels good now. One day it was like 80. Then the next day it was like raining and then almost snowing. And now it's back getting warm again. And it's February. What am I supposed to be showing them? Never mind. I have my candy in, but. Oh, I showed them a little bit. Oh. Yeah. It ain't done. I just want to show them this. I don't know why, I always want to cut a papaya. I've been watching, I think it was Phil Koffer, Koffer, I don't know how you say his name. He always has the raw vegetables and fruit and I think he follows an alkaline diet or he was trying to, but I think he is vegetarian or vegan. So he has like a lot of cool fruits and vegetables and just recipes in general that I kind of want to try. So I want to cut up in this papaya. I think it's good for inflammation. Do you know, mom? Yeah. I, think, oh, I don't know. That. <laughs> I think it might be inflammation or it does help your gut. And I just want to try it in general anyways. So I'm going to prop this up real quick and try to cut me the papaya. I've never done it before. I know it has like seeds and all that in the middle. But we're going to see what it looks like. Oh, it just slices like that. That was smooth. Smooth like a baby box. It smells good. I know people don't eat these seeds this is what throws me off because it kind of looks nasty i'm not gonna lie the inside with the papaya don't they make drinks with it or something you can make like the papaya juice and i don't know about the, not the seeds though replant the seeds <laughs> <laughs> I'll make a whole new papaya. <laughs> that's what that jazz 
I know I'm probably making all kinds of faces. I don't know what part really of the flesh you're supposed to eat. This is my first time doing it. I know the people that were doing it, they just ate it straight out of this. Or I think one video I was watching, he made like a smoothie bowl or something with the, with the pudding and put everything directly in the papaya like this. I guess I'll have this small one to try. The rest I can cut up. Push come to shove, I can always just save it and juice it too. I mean, it looks good. I was so hot, I took my hoodie off and everything. I took the best nap ever just now. Cause that, I had some of that, uh, what is it, the Mucinex? Cause the weather and all that, I'm trying to protect myself. And I made a new recipe, if I didn't show you guys. I'll show you guys later when I perfect it. I'm gonna make a short out of it. But I wanna get back again with the natural fruits, vegetables, not like raw vegan or anything, but just trying some stuff. Okay, I'm scared. Bro. It's not bad. Kenny, I need to know what time you're gonna put the lamb chops. Ooh, I wanted to put some sausage on the grill. Is he grilling the lamb chops? I don't know, man. Okay. Yeah, this is pretty good. I don't know what I was expecting it to taste like. But I think you can't go too much of the skin. Like, you know how uh, watermelon, how when you get too close to the rind, is that what it's called? Yeah. It tastes like hard and not sweet or right. I think that's the same thing how this was. But whatever I don't eat, I'm gonna end up juicing it anyways. But this part tastes pretty good. I think I had it before. You know how they do the little fruit cup? <laughs> you eat it like that. But the only difference with those little fruit cups with the peaches and stuff, they put a ton of sugar in it. And that's the difference. I could eat this. And I see why he eats it like this raw. Especially if it's cold. Summertime. Spring, summer, whatever you want to say, whichever one's coming up. Because at this point, we're getting a whole bunch of it. Yeah, I would definitely buy this again. And of course, you got to go to the international stores. They seem like to be the only one that always have any seasonal fruit right. Probably importing it directly from their countries. That's like one of the best things like we have here in other places, our international stores. Once you start getting used to eating other foods and stuff. Yeah. Because they have so much stuff there. Even like the fruit and everything is better sometimes. Like the fruit and vegetables. I think that's why a lot of times we go to the store a lot. It seems like people think we go shopping and get food all the time. It's because we eat more fresh food, so of course it's not gonna last that long. And we kind of like cook pretty much every day, which is a good thing. Just take a second to appreciate this plate. This came out so good. So I have my gluten-free, dairy-free cornbread. We got some salmon, lamb chops, macaroni and cheese, dairy-free, gluten-free. We got the yams, sweet potatoes. We got some string beans, collard greens, barbecue chicken, and a deviled egg. Y'all, I'm about to smash. This looks so good. It's like Thanksgiving all over again. All right, y'all, I know I'm probably looking real crazy. I'm driving my mom's car, so it's like a little bit different, but I'm on my way to Target, and I'm actually gonna pick my sister up and then probably head to Target somewhere. And I wanna get some stuff. I'm about to go back to press on nails again. I haven't done that in so long, cause you can see I took the other ones I had off. Really, because, so I don't like the one that, um, the gel strip, the kiss one. I like the plain strips, but I don't like the ones that naturally harden, if that makes sense. Let me cut this off because I feel like people can see me. But yeah, I don't like the ones that naturally are already hardened. There's some ones that you put on, they're semi-cured, and you have to put them under the UV light, then they get hard. I was like, what's that, a cop? But no, um, I don't like those ones because they get like, when, if you don't put them on good enough, you see like creases and bumps but if you do a good job you don't have to worry about that but that's why i like the ones that are flat and they come with so many designs and all that but for some reason that semi-cured one i feel like it was a lot of it's been a lot of police because things that go on around this area the whole not my just neighborhood in general just the area itself but no as i was saying that i don't like the way it stripped off that last one you saw me use that was already kind of hardened it kind of stripped off my nails a bit and i'm like if this keeps happening that's the reason why i stopped wearing the acrylic nails and all those so the press-ons i don't think were that bad it almost did the same thing as that one so i'm thinking about getting some more press-ons again so i'm gonna head to target and see what they have i know i was supposed to get like um wipes and other stuff but i'm like I forgot what, a, nail glue, that could be one of them. That's probably what I was forgetting. I was gonna say I kept forgetting something and don't know what it was. I think it was nail glue, but anyways, I'll catch you guys when we get into Target because I'm trying to think too much right now. Yo, it's crazy. 
look how dark it gets now now there's some lighting out here but look how dark it is it's only like seven o'clock right now and it got darker than this by like four o'clock this is crazy <laughs> Okay guys, I also got this thing where I gotta do a review on these two products. So they have them here in Target that I'm gonna try probably tomorrow because I can have coffee now anyways. Okay y'all, it's another day. I'm in the car, I got my nails done. Can you see I did them? I actually really like them. Let me know from afar how they look. Even close up, I think they look decent. I just don't like the way my fat little stubby fingers be looking. But no, today's a really good day. Remember I told you how this weather was so tricky? 80 degrees then rain then some snow like mixed snow then getting warm again it's gonna be 63 today right now my car is saying 48 it's a little chilly when you go out but inside my car i feel warm like, you see i have this thin jacket on and pretty soon after this i'm probably gonna take this off but i'm thinking about going home making some breakfast i seen these pancake hacks before so at the same time i'm trying to film what i eat in the week so i'm trying to record little meals and stuff like that actually no i gotta go to freaking go to Aldi now I'm not gonna do that now so I'm supposed to be making a juice I'm gonna be making this like papaya pineapple orange juice with the leftover fruit that I have home I'll get the other fruit later but that I want to make a new juice and also like I said I've been seeing the pancake recipes and all that I'm gonna put all this on my other video but I want to try this pancake some people did the strips with the bacon I've tried that and I seen the breakfast one where you put the sausage, egg and cheese and bacon and all that stuff and potatoes. I don't think I have a potato, I'm not doing all that, but I'm gonna put egg and sausage in it. And then you can put some maple on it, but I don't need to put maple if I'm gonna put maple on top. Syrup, that's extra sugar, I'm trying to be healthy. Also, I'm gonna set a goal for myself. I wanna try to lose a certain amount of weight for my birthday, whether it's weight, fat, whatever. I'm trying to lose some stuff because um, sometime around my birthday, there's going to be a special event if I had not mentioned it already. I'm trying to keep it a secret maybe, but I feel like I might have said it already, but if you know, you know. So yeah, I want to prepare for that event. I want to make sure I look good and feel good and all that stuff. And that's going to be right around my birthday, which is great. So I want to lose some weight. It's a goal of mine. I'm trying to get back in this health journey. That's why I got the juicer. I'm going to go on a juice cleanse one day. So I got to get some recipes. I got to get some recipes and try to see how I'm going to do it. I don't think I can do the complete juice because, you know, my situation. I have to have certain nutrients and stuff like that. But I'm going to try it anyways and see. Unless I make somewhat of a protein shake. But you'll see later in the future if you have any ideas or you want me to try that let me know but i'm about to go home and make this breakfast i'm not going to stretch it out any longer it looks really nice out this is like a really nice day today i'm not going to lie to you guys but yeah i'm gonna head home real quick focus on the road and i'll show you guys the finished product of my food when i'm done because i am starving okay this is what it turned out i think the people actually put it in the middle and layered it but i don't care this is what i did i did like my blueberries and just put it on top I don't know if this looks good or not, but I know it's gonna taste good, trust me. So I'm gonna pour some syrup and tear it up. Oh, I'm choking. Okay, so this is the juice we're gonna make. Papaya, grape, pineapple, ginger. Ah, shoot, that really hurt. <laughs> no, what is it? It's a baca head. Mom's got turmeric. Oh, no. <laughs> what, this is? Yeah, turn it over, that's what I mean. <laughs> I want this. Like, no. Please. And where's the other no, one? Look what we found. Did you even see this though? No, seriously. Organic sour. Okay, she's not listening to me. <laughs> and we got cinnamon. <laughs> What's up, guys? Back for another day. I have some bad news for you guys. The bad news is this video has came to an end. I hope you enjoyed the vlog so far. I, get, I think this one's a little bit longer, but I kind of had to give you a little bit longer vlog after the last few videos. I kind of been making them a little shorter because they're different style videos. So I figured you probably would like this little week vlog that I did. Also, Timu, you did your thing. I'm definitely going to be ordering some more stuff on there. Speaking of, I put my coffee on, the, my coffee warmer that you saw me get. Why did I not turn it on this whole time? And I I was gone away like 10 minutes. It could have been warming my coffee this whole time. 
I don't know what I was thinking. But to continue on, today's actually the second, but for the first, I did another video that you guys will see later. So you guys gotta comment below and let me know when you want me to drop that video. I'm starting something new. It's only new because it's a fresh start. So that's all I'm gonna say. But I'm gonna be dropping that sometime soon. I'm still working on some stuff for that one. But I wanna give you guys some good wholesome stuff in the videos again because this is a part of, I don't even, I can't even say it because I feel like I'm giving a hint. But either way, it's okay, you guys will see it. So you gotta comment, let me know when you want me to drop that video. It's very weird again, this weather is getting warm, but I think it's gonna get back cold again. It's like 67, 69 today, and then it's gonna drop to like 40 tomorrow. So I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing stuff outside videos, recording inside. You got people's allergies and stuff going crazy because of the weather getting colds and needing mucinex and all kinds of other crap and tea. It's just, it's very weird. Very, very weird. It's Feb, and now it's March. So I don't know what the weather's supposed to be like here. We get all seasons basically in one day almost. One week, one day. I don't know, it's weird. But I have a few places I want to go to and try some places I haven't shown you. Let me know if you guys want to see some museums and things like that. There's some in DC, uh, Quantico, maybe Arlington. Like all kinds of different places you can go to see. And I, I kind of want to go to this Quantico Museum. I don't think I ever showed it on camera. I've been there before, but they upgraded and added new stuff, like with the different wars and stuff like that. And they're gonna be doing more in phases. And there's a couple in DC that I wanna go to. I think I'll be able to film in there. Most likely you can, but leave a comment. Let me know if that's something you wanna see. Cause I'm definitely gonna be doing that soon, especially since the weather is changing a little bit. But I don't wanna go when it's too cold and raining. So hopefully that stops and just kinda of stay somewhere in between, you know, the nice, warm, decent weather where we can go out and do stuff outside. But yeah, I'm not gonna hold you guys any more talk your ears off you guys let me know if you like this video by leaving a comment and also just liking the video and sharing it so we can get it out to more people we're trying to grow the channel where I guess we could say we're on the road to 3k but I want to make a goal to hit 10k so we're gonna be working towards that as well so make sure you tell a friend and tell a friend and grow and then I of course I want to get back to doing giveaways and all that stuff but right now we're trying to grow the family and things like that and then I give you slight giveaways so if you follow me on my Instagram like I said you won't miss those giveaways but as always I appreciate you guys for always watching and supporting but that's gonna wrap up this video and I catch you guys on the next one mm -hmm.